Hello everyone, it's Mal, and today we're going to be opening American Girl Isabel Hoffman and her collection. She is one of the new American Girl dolls that they just recently released in their historical collection. They recently just released twins from the 90s! So this is one of the twins. The other twin is Nikki, and her opening video will be up later. I'm thinking about honestly posting them the same day. I don't know yet, so we'll just see. But anyways, this is the first opening video. Make sure that you're subscribed and following so then you don't miss out on Nikki's. And then I also plan on doing another video over their collection, so make sure that you're subscribed and following so then you don't miss out on all those epic videos, girl. So I feel like without further ado, let's get started. What we're going to be opening today is everything that comes in Isabel's Ultimate Collection. So let's get started! Okay, so the first outfit that we're going to be opening today in this video is Isabel's Floral Dreams Pajamas. These are so cute. These look so cute in, like, the product photos and different photos I've seen of them. So I'm really excited to get this open and, like, get to experience them in real life. <laughs> <gasps> look at how cute this is. Oh, my gosh. O-M-G. Okay, so first we have... The pajama top. Oh my goodness. It is a button up top. The buttons are real, so it doesn't buckle on the back. It's buttoned. Okay, and you have like a cute little collar. Okay, it's long sleeves. You have a cute little clear American Girl tag down at the bottom right corner. Okay, so the pajama top itself is like this light purple slash blue color with pink, yellow, white, and purple flowers all over it. It's so cute. I just love this. I feel like this is giving me much needed spring bra spring vibes <laughs> because it's been really cold where I live recently and I'm just I'm not feeling it. So I feel like this is like, you know, spring vibes all around. Here's the pajama pants. They're really, really cute. They're just like the pajama top. Same color, same flowers on it. They're stretchy up at the top, so you do have a little bit of stretch to get it on your doll. Okay, next we have her slippers. Oh my goodness, these slippers are so cute. So they're little bunnies. Like, oh my goodness, they're hot pink. They're fuzzy. They're really soft. Oh my goodness, I want a pair of these for me. Okay, and then, no, they're not bunnies. They're kitty cats. What the heck, Mal? Anyways, so they're, they're little kitty cats. I guess they could be bunnies. I thought they were bunnies because of little bunny ears that you have up here, but I'm pretty sure they're kitty cats because of little whiskers. But anyways, they're really cute. Love them so much. And then we have a pamphlet. It's Isabel sitting on her bed with her bedroom accessories, wearing her pajamas. Opening it up, you have her by her bed with her bedroom accessory set, wearing her pajamas. And then it tells you how to create a style collage, which is really cute. I like it. One of the outfits that we're going to be opening today in this video is Isabel's tennis outfit. Isabel's into tennis, Nikki's into skateboarding, so I really like that we have different uh, passions and different hobbies. I really think that makes them unique and stuff. This outfit looks to be like really cute. I'm excited. I'm excited for the skirt. The skirt looks really cute. The shoes look really cute. And like the tennis racket. Like girl, I'm excited for this. Ooh, we got some goodies. Okay. As always. Okay, so first thing is the... Oh, it's a one piece! Okay! Okay, so this is actually a dress. I thought the skirt was like not attached, but it's attached. Top of the dress is a sweater. It looks like it's over the dress, but it's actually attached. And it's like this diamond pattern. You have like purple, you have like white, you have this like sky blue, you have green, okay, and then it looks like underneath it that you have like a white short sleeve shirt, but like I said, it is attached, so sadly you cannot break it apart, velcro's in the back, and then the bottom part of the dress is the skirt, it's white, it's ruffly, it's very, very cute, I really like it. Okay, so next we have little underwear that you put on your dolls to make sure that like, um, you know, if she's doing a move, they don't see her undies, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. Anyways, we're gonna, yeah. <laughs> Next we have her socks. Her socks look really cute. Oh my goodness. Her socks are really thick. They're really good American Girl socks. So they're white with a pink, green, and like a sky blue stripe on them. So very, very cute. Next we have her little tennis shoes. Her tennis shoes are really good quality. Oh my gosh, I love them. 
They're just white tennis shoes. Very, very cute. I feel like you could do a lot with white tennis shoes. You can mix and match them. Are we ready for her tennis gear? Okay, so first we have her tennis ball. We have her tennis ball, which is just a plastic yellow ball. You do have some detailing on the ball, so yeah, but it's just plastic. I really wish they would have made this real. I really think that could have been a really cute little detail if they made like actual like cute little real tennis balls, you know what I mean? Okay, so next we have our tennis racket. It's really cute. It's this blue and green tennis racket and then the handle is white and then it does have a handle for your doll to hold it. So, very, very cute. Love that. And then we have a little pamphlet, which is the last thing that you get in the set. It says Isabel, 1989. Has her wearing this outfit, of course, and on her tennis court, which American Girl does sell. So, yeah, and then here she is again on her tennis court. Very, very cute. I heard the tennis, like, ball machine, like, could actually throw the balls, which is really cute. I don't know. I'm going to have to play with that when I go to the American Girl store on March 12th in Nashville. So, then it comes with a cute little game in the play and flip. It tells you about Isabel and stuff, but then it also comes with a would you rather, and it's, like, tennis themes. Okay, so this is Isabel's and Nikki's pet set. You get this in Isabel's Ultimate Collection Bundle and in Nikki's Ultimate Collection Bundle. So, let's see what their pet's are have to offer let's see how cute they are they're gonna be so cute oh my goodness you get two pets in this you know one for Nikki one for Isabel I'm so excited I love pets I love American Girl pets Ooh! I think they're ready to come out oh my goodness okay you ready ready We have a kitty, very, very cute. It's brown, light brown, and some dark brown, and some medium brown, some tan. But look at the cute, adorable face. Oh my goodness. It's very soft. Usually the historical pets and the Girl of the Year pets, they're not posable like the Truly Me pets are. So sadly, this kitty is not posable like the Truly Me kitties. But very soft little stuffed animal that I just absolutely love. Okay. And then I think we have we have one more pet that's that's getting ready to come out. Oh, oh, oh. <gasps> Look! Oh! oh my goodness, so this is like a chocolate labradoodle puppy. Listen, I don't even know my pet breeds, so I apologize if this is not. It's a brown um puppy. He reminds me of chocolate chip. From, if you guys are really old, well, not old, American Girl Collective, but uh, back in, like, 2012, maybe? Kind of in that time period, American Girl, uh, they had out a cute little puppy that, that literally looked like this, and his name was Chocolate Chip. I have him in the doll room, actually. Where is he? Where, where is he? Where, what room is he in? I think, I can't remember where I put him, but he's somewhere in the doll room, vibing and living his best life. So, yeah, he looks like he could be, this puppy could be like siblings with chocolate chip from the old My American Girl line. Very, very cute. And then the last thing that you get in this pet set is a cute little pamphlet that says Nikki Isabel, well, it says Isabel Nikki in 1999 with Isabel and Nikki in uh with their beds kind of so Isabel's sitting on her bed wearing her pajamas with her cat her bedroom accessories and Nikki is by her bedroom accessories with her dog they're both wearing their pajamas like how cute opening it up it has Isabel and Nikki modeling their pajamas along with their pet sets in their journals and then it talks about how to draw a sleepy kitten a, a sleepy kitten my bad and a playful puppy Oh, that's really cute. I love that. Okay, so now we're going to be opening Isabel's accessories. These are super, super cute. I'm so excited. Look at the goodies that we have going on in this box. So first we have the hat. It's this purple kind of, oh, what's it, what's it called? It's like a, ooh, it's a certain kind of like 
I, I associate it with Paris, okay? The back of the box literally just calls it a hat, but it's like a baronet or something, a baronet. I'm gonna be so embarrassed that I said that. I'm gonna be editing this video and I'm gonna think of the name. And I'm gonna be like, why could I not think of that name? Okay, and then she has some buttons. It says kindness count, it's pink, has a heart on it, and then the other button is just a little uh, killer whale and the ocean. Very, very cute, okay? So then we have her backpack. This backpack is really super duper cute. It's a clear backpack, okay? So you can see everything that's inside, but the pouch uh, that opens is this is not clear. It's purple color with some flowers on it. You have a white flower, a blue flower, and a pink flower. Velcro's open. As you can see, on the outside you, you can fit a lot of it in, and then the straps are this purple color. And next we have her journal, it says Isabel, my journal, 1999, with a butterfly, smiley face, another butterfly, girl power, and a rainbow on it. And then it has some of her writings in it, and then it also has blank pages, so then you can fill the journal up with, you know, her adventures of her in your doll room. Next we have her necklace. This is such a cute little necklace. Oh my gosh. So first of all, it's this clear, it's very stretchy, okay, it's kind of like a choker um, a little bit, kind of reminds me of that. It has pink and blue flowers on it and stuff, so yeah, and they're clear flowers, so you can see through them, very, very cute. Okay, next we have her sunglasses. These are really cute, oh my gosh, okay. The sunglasses are these really pretty uh, purple slash pink color. Very, very cute. Love them. They're just plastic. And next up, it looks like we have some stickers. Yes, they're called stickers. So you have some hearts, you have some flowers, you have some butterflies. Very, very cute little stickers. Maybe put in your backpack, put in Isabel's journal. Whatever you want to do with these stickers. Whatever your heart desires. The time has come where we're going to be opening Isabel. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Wait, I need my scissors. I did not play on this at all. I'm very excited for the 90s dolls. I think they're just super duper cute. Her and Nikki. I love the fact that they're twins. Like, this is something that American Girl has not done before, make twin dolls. So, I'm very, very excited that we have some twin dolls. Because I obviously have some twins in my collection, but they're not official, you know, like American Girl twins, if that makes sense. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Okay, so first thing, when you open her box, you get her journal. It says, Isabel, my journal. And this is basically her book, except in journal form. So, yeah, it's just like Kavi's. From my understanding. So yeah, it looks really, really cute in the pages and stuff. I really like this. Oh my goodness, I can't wait to read it. Oh my goodness, she is just so cute. Look at her in the box. I personally love her meat outfit. We're gonna talk about it here in a couple few minutes. But she is just adorable. Ready? Here she is. Ah, she looks so Okay, so I did turn the brightness a little bit up so you can kind of see her beautiful, gorgeous green eyes. These eyes are the same eyes as Felicity's, so I'm really excited to see the return of these eyes because these eyes, they like, American Girl hardly uses them, so I'm very excited that they're back. So, as you can see, like, they're very, very, very pretty in this, like, bright setting, so... She's just a gorgeous dolly. I believe she has the Joss face mold. I kind of seen people go back and forth between saying that she has a Marie Grace face, the Marie Grace face mold, or the Joss one. She looks like to me that she has the Joss one. Can also see Marie Grace in there, but she, hey, she's a gorgeous doll either way. Okay, so now going on to her meat outfit. Her meat outfit's really pretty. It's super duper cute. So first, she has the shirt that is purple stripes and white and it's buttoned kind of down the bottom so then she has the shorter shirt on top of it but it's actually attached to the shirt itself this is a kind of like a half sweater it is this purple color so it is attached to the purple and white striped shirt I really wish it could come apart because I think that would have been like a really cute little detail and really cute to mix and match it with other outfits but it sadly can't Next we have the skirt. The skirt is super duper cute, okay? It's like this plaid design, okay? You have pink, you have this gray, 
slash white kind of color. You have this darker purple slash burgundy. And then you have a clear American Girl tag down at the right court, uh, bottom. Then she has knee-high socks, socks that just stop right at her knee, which is really cute. And then she has these cute little purple platform shoes, which I absolutely love. I think they're just super duper adorable and just, oh, I just love them so much. American Girl did such a great job with her mean outfit, in my opinion. I just, I love it. I really think it's really cute. It's definitely giving me 90s uh, aesthetic, you know what I mean? Okay, so now let's take off her wig, her hairnet, not her wig, her hairnet. I always, get, always say it's like her wig cap, which it's not. Okay, you ready? Oh my goodness, her hair is like really stunning. I'm going to have to brush her hair. Her hair is really, really cute. It, it is on the short side, so this is like a great first doll for someone because it is on the short so it, side, so it is very easy to manage. She has blonde and kind of like this brown uh, slash dark brown highlights in her hair. So I feel like that's really cool. And I feel like American Girls kind of experience like experimenting with their hair highlights, which I really like because I really think that adds a level to the dolls being kind of like real life and like unique and like really cool. So yeah, her hair is a bit on the short side. It does go down to her chest. It's super duper pretty. I really love her. So guys, please welcome Isabel Hoffman to the Dollies and Rainbows family. Alrighty everyone, so that was opening everything in Isabel's Ultimate Collection. I'm very, very excited to have her and her twin in my doll room, in my doll family, you know, part of my collection. I really think American Girl did a really, really excellent job with her and her twin. I absolutely love everything in Isabel's collection. I can't wait to get my hands on more of her collection because I really want to get her Pizza Hut bucket set and her computer set and like her bedroom accessories I just think are so cute. So yeah, a lot of things are not on the wish list, they're on the needs list. Do you know what I mean? You know what I mean. So make sure you go watch Nikki's video where I open Nikki. It's her twin and her pieces and her ultimate collection. Um, so make sure you go check that out as well because Nikki is a beautiful doll. She's stunning. She's gorgeous. And her collection is just as awesome as Isabel's. Really recommend everything in Isabel's collection. Like I said, everything's made with really good quality. Like these are like really qual good quality dolls and they have really made, really well made meat outfits and everything's just made really well in their collection. I'm, I'm impressed. American Girl, they did not come to play, queen. So thanks for watching this video, everyone. I hope you all enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on my Instagram if you haven't done so already. It's the same name, Dollies and Rainbows. Check me out on TikTok as well, Dollies and Rainbows. I also just posted a new episode of my Doll Mom podcast, my podcast called Doll Mom. Episode 16 is out now on your favorite uh, music podcast listening platform, so be sure to go check it out. I just posted it literally yesterday, so it's very new, very fresh. So definitely, definitely give it a listen because it has on, I have on one of my best friends in the doll community. So give this video a like if you enjoyed it. Comment down below what you think of Isabel, what you think of her collection, what's your favorite piece, what piece are you hoping to add to your collection, what did you buy from Isabel's collection, what are you hoping to buy, anything. Get the conversation started down below if you're able to, of course. And yeah, I think that's it. I think that's all I have to tell you. I'll see you next time. Bye!